So we are going to set up the printer. This is the power adapter. We need to first connect the power cord, power adapter. Then put it in the power source. And now we can put it the power source. Now we need to connect the power plug into the socket. As you can see, printer got the power. Now open it from the side buttons. And this is the DT rule. When we slide it little bit and uh, we release it, it will fix automatically. Then we will adjust clock and close it. Now power on. So it will automatically calibrate. Ready to use. So we have set up the printer. Now we are going to install it in our system by Bluetooth. So first of all, we need to install this printer. So we are going to download their driver from their official website. Okay. So here it is on the driver page. We need to scroll down and here it is the t45 driver windows driver now load it so i have already downloaded the driver okay so here is uh, one thing we need to remember for this printer there is a technical that you know for even with installing with Bluetooth we need to install it one time for the first use from the USB if we click on next it will not detect the printer so we need to connect it through the USB cable which come along with the printer so I have inserted the USB cable now I have click on the next as you can see it has auto detected the printer now going to click on next and here it is installed successfully so now we need to check from the control panel here we go device and printers So in Windows 11, you will also see the similar interface like this. So from for any Bluetooth printer, you will not able to see the Bluetooth connection from here. You can do from here, add a device, but from here it won't connect. So we need to go to advanced setting. For that, you need to click view more devices. Then you need to find downside the small device and printer setting after clicking this you will get the advanced setting like windows 10 and 7 so here you can see we have installed the printer t45 which is here but now we need to collect it to the bluetooth so right now i have inserted the usb so it is coming here now i have removed the usb and as you can see the printer has been removed and this also became inactive now i'm going to click on add a printer yeah here it is T45 
okay so now it is connected through the bluetooth now we need to check it from which port it is working so we need to right click on this printer we need to go properties then services and here as we can see serial port com10 now we need to remember this com10 and now we need to click on this installation file this t45r now we need to click on printer properties we need to go on the ports tab and here we need to find the com10 which we have just find out in this service okay com10 and here we will select the com10 just simply apply and ok ok and here is also ok but still you can see here now it became active ok if in your printer if it is showing inactive you need to right click and click on see what's printing then printer and you have to untick it use printer offline so now this printer is fully functional let's give it a test page print so my test page print has came please try it if you have any doubt you can let me know in the comments